What is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and today we're doing a wrestling, well, an unrelated video to wrestling as I am talking about KSI versus Logan Paul, the boxing fight and at the time of this recording, it is tomorrow night uh, here in the UK, it's the pay-per-view starts at midnight I don't know what time the fight will go on, obviously boxing's unpredictable uh, they could go one round, they could go the whole rounds, like, you know it's it's completely unpredictable, so it's not like wrestling where everything has its own time slot. Um, and essentially, this video is just going to be me telling you guys that I will be watching. Uh, I hopefully will be reacting. I have work Sunday morning. Um, uh, well, no, I have work all day Sunday. Uh, I don't finish till five. And I will be staying off social media. Um, hopefully, I'll get up in the morning early enough to watch and react in the morning. But if not, then I will unfortunately have to react like later. So my reaction video won't be up until later Sunday evening. Uh, but hopefully I can do it in the morning, edit it and upload it. Um, but, you know, that is a that is a big task uh, just in the minimal hours that I have. So fingers crossed, you know, we're all good. But anyway, my prediction for the fight. Now, first off, let me get into this. I am not massive into boxing. Uh, some of you personally know I do train in kickboxing. Uh, but actual boxing, I don't really know many of the rules. I don't know anything like that. Um, and essentially people say that, you know, kickboxing is just boxing with kicks. But, you know, I don't fight professionally. Um, I literally just train kickboxing. Um, so I'm unsure of the rules. But however, I do know how fights work. Um, and in my mind, firstly... I hate how it's sort of like a battle of countries and America have made it this way. Um, no offence to you guys, but Logan Paul and everyone saying, you know, um, like, you know, America are better than you and stuff like that. And it's just like, why this doesn't need to be a battle of countries. Um, as we all know, the UK and America are best friends. Uh, so UK, USA, we're on good terms. Um, don't make this a war. Obviously not an actual war, like, you know, it'll be a Twitter war. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's get into my actual predictions. So, for those of you that don't know, uh, KSI actually, when he started making YouTube videos, he lived 10 minutes away from me, and he actually went to school with one of my close friends, his older brother. So, you know, KSI is sort of a local, you know, big thing around here. In my area, we have a lot of local people uh, that came, and a lot of famous people that came from here, people like Elton John, Anthony Joshua, KSI, uh, all in like a 30 mile radius around me. Um, and because of that, I am cheering KSI on. Now, let me get this straight. I'm not the biggest fan of either people. I used to love KSI back when he made FIFA videos back in the day. Uh, but recently, I think he's a bit of a, you know, I think some of the stuff he's done is questionable. Uh, some of the way he's like the way he's acted is questionable. He can come across quite rude, uh, and quite arrogant. Logan Paul is a dickhead, um, and Jake Paul is an absolute. Uh, well, I'll see you next Tuesday. Um, and like literally, I hate Jake Paul with a passion. I think he's rude. I think he's a prick, uh, especially in his recent interview with Joe Weller. Joe Weller, I absolutely love, um, but that's just you know my YouTube personal preferences. We don't need to get into that. I believe that Logan has it in him to knock JJ out within the first three rounds. However, if Logan does not do that, I believe that KSI, JJ will take advantage and will beat Logan in the later rounds. Do I believe there's going to be a knockout? As much as they are hyping it, and they're both, well, in the recent press conference especially, JJ guaranteed a knockout... I don't think it's going to have a knockout, I think, or like, you know, a clean knockout. It will be stopped at anything. I just think it will be straight up stopped. Um, or it will go the whole way and we'll get points again, which obviously if they do another draw, I will throw this Mario toy at my TV. Um, and it's just... So, yeah, I want KSI to win. I currently believe that Logan Paul will win. As much as I hate that. Because I know both men will brag about it like crazy. But I know Logan will brag much more than JJ will. And it's so annoying. And yeah, I just... Oh, I really don't like Logan Paul or any of the Pauls. I think they are just not 
great people, uh, especially Jake. He's a, oh, I hate Jake Paul. Um, but yeah, there we go. So once again, my prediction, I can't predict it. I really can't predict it. Screw it. KSI is winning. That's what I want. That's what I'm predicting. But don't moan at me in the comment section of my reactions video if it goes the other way. Because I think Logan has it in him 100% to beat JJ. I think they both can beat each other. It all depends on how they fight on the actual day. I think that it could go really bad as well. Like part of me believes someone could be hospitalized. You know, it's boxing. None of these guys have ever fought professionally before with 10 ounce gloves and no head guards. And I've, I can tell you, I fought 10 ounce gloves with head guards, just in sparring, and that shit hurts. So with no head guards, they're gonna, that moment is gonna hit them where they're taking the jabs, they're taking the crosses, they're taking these punches and it's, they're going to realise I've got no protection here whatsoever. I need to get my hands up. Otherwise, I'm going to lose. Um, and straight up, apparently, according to KSI, no one else knows. Uh, Logan's jab last time was apparently just, literally just to keep him back. He was literally just touching him. Um, so, if he's just hitting him with the jab just because then I think KSI is going to win again. Because once KSI gets on the inside, it's all his. You know, he can throw the uppercuts, he can throw the hooks. But it's just one of them. I Honestly, I, I didn't mean for this video to be this long. If you've stayed, then hi. Uh, if you're new, then hi. Uh, I don't normally waffle on this long, but I genuinely don't know what to say. This is such a big thing when it comes to YouTube. Such a big thing. Uh, to the point where, as cool as it would have been, but at the same time it would have been hated on, people were actually commenting when I was rivals with Kip Clips. They were like, oh my God, book Kip versus Joe on the undercard. It's like, you know this is boxing, not wrestling. We will literally get booed out of the arena. Um, but yeah, once again, happening in LA. This time it's in Logan's territory. I don't think that affects the decision. Just seeing interviews from people like Joe Weller interviewing the public. A lot of people are in favour of KSI. Uh, but then again, a lot of people hate KSI. But then again, a lot of people hate Logan Paul. So realistically, I don't think there's going to be a great result that comes out of this at all. I think both YouTubers, whether they win or lose, are just going to absolutely go crazy. But I feel like if, if it could be bad for the loser. Like, Joe Weller has taken his loss very well you know he knows what he, he knows what he did wrong he knows that what to improve on it's just he doesn't want to step foot in a boxing ring and that's a very manly way to do it i don't think logan and ksi's egos could take a loss like literally uh, but let me know what you guys think. Um, once again, this Saturday, Sky Sports Box Office, if you're in the UK, uh, £9.95. It's really not that expensive, to be honest. I thought it was going to be at least 20 Uh But no, surprisingly cheap, which is great for me this side of Christmas. <laughs> uh, but anyways, I will see you guys in the next video, and hopefully I'll see you in my reaction video. Goodbye.